After a strong mob of miscreants vandalized Kolkata's R.G. Kar Hospital on Thursday night in India's eastern state of West Bengal, Kolkata police have detained at least 19 suspects in connection with the vandalism at the college and hospital. Those suspects were identified by citizens after social media posts. In the latest, the father of the victim has now turned down the compensation offered by the state government. Listen to this. Life is not a good thing. We have to do this. 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 The Indian Medical Association has now declared a 24 hour nationwide withdrawal of services in a show of support for the doctors. The announcement comes as we claim the night march held in support of the rape and murder of 31 year old trainee doctor in Kolkata's RG. RG Kar Medical College and Hospital was attacked by hundreds of vandals. The official statement issued by IMA, the doctors will stay on strike on 24 hours till 6 a.m. local time on Sunday and OPD services will remain closed. Doctors from all government and private hospitals affiliated with IMA will be on strike. Bengal Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee is also set to hold a protest march in Kolkata today. The Chief Minister has also asked the Central Bureau of Investigation probing into the accident incident delivered to deliver justice within next Sunday. Prime Minister Narendra Modi in his Independence Day speech also mentioned the incident and urged the Indian society to self-reflect on the crimes committed against women. Any that? The heinous rape and murder of Kolkata's trainee doctor has brought back the memories of the 2012 Delhi rape case, which has raised concerns of women's safety in Indian society and had become a catalyst for police and judicial reforms surrounding the issue.